In this video, we're going to show you the difference between the Spinfire standard clamp and the Spinfire automatic clamp. This machine has two standard clamps, but for the purpose of this demonstration, we've added a third clamp on being the automatic clamp. So if I push that out of the way, we focus on just the Spinfire standard clamp. So this clamp requires you to obviously first clamp onto the strings. If you imagine you had a racket up here, so that's clamped onto the string and then you lock the base clamp in place to prevent it moving along the track. Now, the way that works is the harder I, or tighter I lock it, the tighter it holds in place. And to unlock it, I have to push back the other way. It is spring-loaded, so it's pretty easy to load and unload. Some of the cheaper clamps are not actually spring-loaded. So you press it that way and you unlock. If I press even harder, then it locks even tighter and I can unlock it. With the automatic clamp, it's, there's no pressure really required. You either lock it or you unlock it. There's no in-between. There's no difference. You can't go past that point. It's just a very simple locking and unlocking process. Um, the other beautiful thing about these clamps is it has an automatic unlocking process. So when you've locked it in place and you've got the string clamped here, you release the clamp on the string and you drop it and it unlocks the base clamp. So lock, unlock, lock, unlock. Very simple. It can save you a lot of time on every racket restring. 